Hi, this is Robert with Omnitracks, and today I'm going to be reviewing the State Miles section of the Analytics Manager app. So here you can see a few different reports, last six months trend by month, last six months trend by state, state miles by group type, uh, and then state miles for all vehicles driven in the United States, state miles for all vehicles driven in Canada and Mexico, and state miles for a specific vehicle. So here uh, is the last six months trend by month. So you can see the last six months here. And then the amount of miles driven uh, for each month and uh, for each state. So here you can see in Alabama in October, uh, there was 132.9 miles driven in Alabama. Uh, in November, there was 810.5 miles driven in Alabama. Uh, in December, there was 66.3. Uh, in January, there was 491.4. In February, there was 325.9. In March, there was 1,020.8. And then here you can see miles by state total. So there was a total of 2,847.8 miles driven in the last six months in Alabama. So here you can see the last six months trend by state. And this particular report uh, doesn't actually populate on the screen here, so you can download it. And I forgot to mention that you can also download this report and any report uh, within the State Miles section of the Analytics Manager app. So uh, there's an Excel format, there's a PowerPoint format, and there's a .csv format available for you. And you can also view this data in a table or a chart. So last six months trend by state. Like I said, uh, this is not populating on the screen here, but what, what we do is uh, we can just go ahead and download this, this report, open it up, and then here we can see the miles driven uh, in each state. Uh, it's broken out uh, between states and, and the miles driven for each state. So here uh, it's the same figure we were looking at before, uh, 2,000. 847.8 miles driven in Alabama within the last six months. So here is the state miles by group type. Uh, this particular account I'm in today doesn't have many different groups or vehicles assigned to different groups so uh, we're, we're just going to focus on the group type uh, named Depot. Uh, so for this video I'm going to select 2017 quarter one and the group type I'm going to keep is all. So here you can see uh, the different groups broken out and then here uh, for the depot group you can see the total mileage, group mileage, and then here you can see the miles driven in each state uh, for that particular group. You can also download this report uh, in, the, in an Excel format, a PowerPoint format, or a .csv. Then I'm also going to take you into uh, the state miles for a specific vehicle report. So here uh, it's asking me to enter a vehicle ID, so I'm going to enter vehicle ID 3918, and then it wants me to select a quarter, so I'm going to keep it at 2017 quarter one and then a start date and an end date. And I'm just going to keep all choices selected here. So here you can see for vehicle ID 3918, uh, you, you can see um, the amount of miles driven uh, for each date within the date range that I selected. So because I selected all choices and all choices, uh, it's showing me from January 2017 all the way to March 29th of 2017. And you can see here that on January 1st of 2017, uh, this specific vehicle drove a total of 508.4 miles in the United States. And those miles were driven in Tennessee and Virginia. So 178.3 miles in Tennessee and 330.1 miles in Virginia. And this concludes uh, today's review of the state miles section in the Analytics Manager app. Again, my name is Robert. 
with Omnitracks, and I appreciate your time.